So Megan, you will have many people welcoming you to this school, but I am honored to be the first and in this particular way to say welcome to the Ellis School Thank and you. how grateful we are to you for being our 15th head of school. And I feel really good about you being the person to carry on into the next century for Ellis. And you'll have that sense of just love that comes your way that uh -huh. I think will catch you by surprise. Thank you. I know you're going to be very missed here. From the very first interview I had here, I felt kind of embraced and welcomed. I felt like I could make this place my home. In fact, one of the things that I think about uh, is the wonderful balance you have of business background along with your deep understanding and wonderful career as an educator. Well, I started out in the business world and then I had an opportunity to uh, move into the classroom, but I think all of that positions me well for this next challenge and this next adventure of coming to a new city and a new school and making a new home uh, in a different kind of role that I feel really ready for. I'm really excited about um, sort of Pittsburgh's stage of life. Uh, we found a house in the neighborhood. I wanted to live nearby, I like to be near school. My husband and I both tend to really want to be involved in the communities we live in. And um, my husband and I are lucky to have had three wonderful children, raised them in St. Louis, Missouri. They're all grown now. I have a daughter and two sons. So it's exciting to think about an all-girls school, and, and people have asked me, why are you going to an all-girls school? Um, and to me, that's an easy answer. Ellis has certain core beliefs and ways of being that are really focused on what's best for girls and creating an environment in which they can be fully themselves uh, and can find their voices and their, their passion. And that's the kind of school community I believe in. It's the kind of school community I've worked in. Um, it's the kind of one of my own children to go to. So I'm, I'm a, a deep believer in that way of organizing school and building a school. My hope is that girls and families, when they walk into Ellis, can quickly tell what Ellis stands for and is trying to be and that when alums come back in 20 years, it still feels like Ellis, but not the same Ellis, because it's changing to be what it should be in that era. But I can't wait to actually get here, and um, I feel like I'm really poised well to now meet more of the community, and I look forward to that so much.